sometimes when people make something and they want to print it out, it may be too tall for them to print out. They might need to do it in sections. And to split those sections, you might, uh, you'll need to split the bodies. So, um, what uh, I'm going to just show you how to split those bodies, and then I'll show you what I would do if I was putting them together, like trying to glue them together. A uh, simple way to do this. So, I'm going to go over here. Um, And I'm going to go to this body here. I'm not going to do that. Um, and uh, that's not what I'm going to do. I'm going to put a plane in. I'm going to say I want that plane, offset plane. And then I'm going to say I want it. It's six inches tall, so I'm going to go up three and say OK. Then this is a something that I didn't know how to do in the past, but you can you need to expand this plane to be able to cut it. Alright, so now that goes all the way through the object. Now I can go up here to uh, modify and go to split body. And then the body to split, it asks me that, select it, okay good. And then the splitting tool, That's, the splitting tool is this plane here. And select the splitting tool. There we go. And I'm going to say OK. Now I've got two bodies, right? And um, I'm going to um, take one of them, I'm going to make one of them disappear with my little eye here. Then I'm going to go take this one, um, and I'm going to put some construction lines on this. Uh, let's see, I'm going to make a sketch. Create a sketch, and then I'm going to go to construction lines and I'm going to simply go make a line between the corners. Another line between the corners. And then I'm going to make a circle. Um, and hit C for circle. That did not work. And I'm going to go to that point. This is hard to see, but I'm there. All right. And then, you know, this does not matter that much, but you have to make sure you're doing, you type this in. All right. So let's say I want a quarter inch pin. Um, then I'm going to put in uh, 0.25 on this diameter. Um, I'm going to get out of the construction line, and uh, that should be good. So I'm going to hit return. All right, and then I'm going to finish the sketch. And then we're going to go here, and I'm going to Pick that, hit P for, well, not for, for cancel that. Uh, finish the sketch, okay. I'm gonna hit E for extrude, and then I'm going to pull that down, and I'm going to um, say that that's gonna be, oh, I don't know, uh, also gonna be 0.25 will keep it kind of consistent. Um, and, um, but I don't, negative 
So I put my little pin in. So I've got that. Now I'm going to make that disappear and open up my other body. And let's make sure I know what I'm doing here. Okay. Make sure I got my uh, the correct one open. I'm going to do the same thing here. Right click. Um, create a sketch, and then I'm going to go in and go construction line, hit L for line, draw a center point, then I'm going to go in, get out of that, uh, construction, go to circle, and I'm going to make a tiny bit bigger circle than I did before um, by a 64th of an inch. So um, well maybe, maybe a 32nd. So that would be 16 30 seconds. Uh, nope. Uh, let's see, 8 30 seconds and a quarter of an inch. So 9 30 seconds. Um, uh, probably the Engl the metric system would be a little easier here, but uh, 9, 32. And then uh, I'm going to finish the sketch, and I'm going to get back into my other view, and then I'm going to Now I'm going to make this cut, and I'm going to go down just a little bit more than that quarter inch. So I think I'll go down uh, 0.3. Make sure I'm cutting and say OK. Now, um, in order to see this, there is a way to inspect and then um, go in and, and see this, but I've forgotten, I think maybe it is section analysis. Uh, let's just see. Yeah, you can see there that those will line up pretty well. Right. And you should be able to put some glue in there and get them that that's going to help you line those up so that there really isn't uh, much of any gap in, be, in between there. And it just is it's very helpful to have a little pin there. Uh, there's other ways to do this, I'm sure, but this is a pretty simple and straightforward way of, of, of getting splitting some bodies and then making something uh, so it will line up in the, in the future when you want to glue them together.